Well, hello everyone. It's your buddy Danielson with you, and today I have a 2003 Honda Odyssey with a transmission that's gone out. Those of you who know much about the Odysseys know this is a common issue, and so it's either going to be a rebuild or just to just a replace the whole thing. But my job, thank God, isn't to rebuild it or to replace it. I'm just towing it. So. I've got my excursion, got my trailer, I've got 158,000 on this thing, got a couple lights on there, and up we go. What I was told is it's stuck in first, sometimes it has no reverse, it had reverse this morning when we backed it out of the other shop, but let's hope we get up on the trailer, that's all I'm worried about. see how that looks. And the reason I bought this trailer instead of using my other flatbed that has the side rails is because I couldn't do what I did just right there. Open the door. Okay. A little bit close. I'm going to back up and uh, get over a little bit more. A little close to the side there. So let's move over a little bit. Now that we're all centered up, pretty close. Got all the chains in place, so this van isn't going to go anywhere. One here, one here, cross underneath. Got the parking brake set all the way. And we're in park. We're set to go. Here we are, about to get on an interstate. Build up a little speed. You can definitely tell the van's back there. It's heavy. But it pulls great. Next one. <laughs> Probably the most amazing thing about this truck is how smooth the ride gets when you put a load like this on it. This ride is so smooth when it's loaded up, especially with that camper, than it is without a dry load. That back of the vehicle doesn't bounce around all over the place with that one ton frame. Next stop, Illinois. Okay, here I am in Illinois at a place called CNN Transmissions. They're going to take the van from here, pretty much. Last job for me is to back it off the trailer. So, let's get this done. If I can find the key. That's not it. That's not it. There it is. Of course, it's the one in the bottom of my pocket. There we go. Well, that's not good. 
Well, I got lucky. The key did not fit in the driver's or passenger's door, but it fit in the very back door of the van. So we got lucky there. All right, let's get this off. Break off. All right, and here we go. I would take it for a drive to see uh, what exactly is wrong with it, demonstrate, but the guy asked me not to. That's alright. There we go. My job is done.